Okay, Lillian, this is for you. Oh, there's my little dog. So, I have the package that Sweet Lily sent me of soaps and all kinds of fun stuff. I have no idea because I have not opened it yet, but I'm really excited. And sorry, uh, this is my first video, so I have no idea what I'm doing. Just winging it, purely for Lily. And I have my trusty scissors opening now. Sorry for the lull. As I dig in, man, Lily, you take this good. I'm very excited, by the way. I mainly just thought that it would be really cool because I've watched so many of Lily's videos and um, and so I feel like I know her but she's never seen me or heard me talk or interact or anything so mm. Ooh. okay so this is the little dog blanket oh my gosh it is so cute can you see it there? Now, Lily has big dogs, and she got this in a fun box, and I sent her a picture of my dogs, one of which just had cancer, and, uh, and so she had her tail removed. And she's a little chihuahua mix. She was the one that was in here earlier. Of course, she has decided this is not the place to be. She wants to go exploring the rest of the house. But I'm gonna get a cute picture of this with Rowdy, and it's got a little uh, chimpanzee, it looks like. So I can't wait to figure out when I can get that done and, uh, and the perfect photo. Next we have all oh, little keep your dogs from barking socks. Okay, those are really stinking cute. Love them. And they look really nice. They've got a little, they're by stride line, and they've got a little cloth tag there. Very fancy Lily. Love them. Thank you. And mainly what I was wanting from her was some of her soaps and stuff. So we'll see when we get to that part. But. Oh, I just saw, so I opened this up, but I'm gonna set that to the side for now because it looks like that's mainly her soaps. And I want that to be last. Oh, got some headbands. Those will always come in handy. Got a little black one. By Lucy. I always wanted a dog named Lucy. I thought that would be a cool name. Then I've got a little snake skin. I don't see a brand on this. I don't know, if, am I doing this right, Lily? And then it looks like another Lucy one. Looks like that one might be a little bit newer. I think that I'm supposed to do this or something. Oh no, I'm backwards or something. I don't know how to fix that. Okay, now we have soaps. Oh, my card. Okay, she says, I have to share with Bryn. And of course it's backwards, so I apologize for that. And I will try to, no promises. I loved my card. I'm not going to share it, but it was very, very sweet. And, um, and I loved it. And I love Lily. 
Lily. Oh my gosh. Now, if you guys follow Lily, you know that she made this soap for a fundraiser. So there was no way that I was going to ask her for one of these because they were specifically already, um, already spoken for. But this is the most beautiful soap with July 4th themed. And again, backwards, sorry, I don't know how to fix that. Maybe Lily can help me with that. But that soap is absolutely beautiful. And again, was not expecting that because those were specifically made for a purpose. And, um, and this is what made me reach out to Lily and think I need to give her soaps a try. So thank you, thank you, thank you for that. Okay, we have a Tahitian Breeze Solid Body Butter. Now I think that this is the one that she was saying that she was worried about how it would travel, but it seems to have fared pretty well, especially considering that it was, oh, and she double wrapped it. Um, considering that it was coming from Tennessee to North Carolina, so both pretty hot, especially in July. Oh my gosh, it smells divine. I'm so excited. Thank you so much for, for shipping this. And by the way, just so that you know, it is beautiful, all in one piece, no issues, no melting, no anything. Absolutely gorgeous. So now you know how they travel. And it's lovely. And I'm very excited. I think that this is one of the, uh, the fancy ones. So I'm very excited that I got lucky enough to, uh, to get to try it. Oh, little corgi socks, buttons and bones. Those are really cute. Love those. You know, our fur babies, I never had kids, so my fur babies are officially my children and spoiled rotten, as they should be. Okay, I am down to this box, which the box is beautiful, by the way, and I will definitely get some good use out of it, so thank you. So I have Serenity Grace Peaceful Handmade Soap. Again, backwards. Don't know how to fix it. Maybe I'll figure it out. It won't be today, though. Oh my gosh, that smells amazing. Then I have Tea Tree and Geranium Turmeric. Wow. That one is, that is so nice. It has such a, you wouldn't expect for that, sorry for the shaking, that's my RA, awesome. Um, but you wouldn't expect for that ha to have such a clean scent, but it really does. Love that. Ease up, handmade soap. Oh. These are so nice. Clary Sage and Sweet Orange. Lily, these are honestly unlike any other homemade soaps that I've smelled. So many times when I smell them, they have, um, I don't know the scent, but almost like a patchouli 
um, end up pretty strong, but these are absolutely amazing. You can really tell the difference between somebody that's uh, first getting started in soap making and somebody that's at your level. L level. And this one is Relax Lavender. It's a lavender scent, which of course this is going to be Bryn's favorite. She is a lover of all lavender and um, that is so nice and I don't stand a chance with this one. She'll say Lily said to share and that one needs to be mine. And she's right. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Coconut lime verbena. I think that that's how you say that. Right there. And it's so cute because it has a little coconut. Are you kidding me? That is amazing. Lily, I am so excited about this box. It has been killing me. Killing me to open up. And I actually rigged. <laughs> I'm sitting here in my living room and I finally just said the heck with it I'm gonna figure this out because Bryn is studying for her a summer final and I have asked her for three days now since Saturday really since Friday can we please do this unboxing because I really want to at least get a video I probably won't share it with anyone but I do want to take the time so that Lily can at least see it and she's just been so busy and we keep such opposite schedules. So right now she is getting ready for bed after studying all day long. And I said, I'm going to figure this out. So I have my iPad set up um, in the living room with a table propped against a box. It seems to be working though, so okay. Um, and I'm, I'm guessing... I'm guessing... Are, is this the shampoo and conditioner? I see something, I I don't know. Oh. I do have another soap in here. I'm guessing that this is the shampoo and conditioner, but I'm not 100% sure. She had mentioned that she was sending me um, her shampoo and conditioner. but And I did miss something in this box. It is gorgeously packaged by the way with all kinds of wraps for everything and bubble wrap and pretty pink beautifully packaged this was so incredibly thoughtful I can't thank you enough oh and then fresh linen uh, one of my favorite scents mmm and it is so cute because it has on top. Now, I don't want to misspeak. Oh, I love that scent. It is so clean to me. But it looks like a roll of either paper towels or toilet paper. I apologize for the light. That is my above light. And... I don't know, Lily, what is that? Is that... Is it a little surfboard? Or a little beer? I don't know. But it is so cute. It's really, really cool. So, that's all that I have. And I just want to say thank you again. And my first video. I have no idea how to edit. I have no idea how to fix lighting or any of that stuff. And, um, and so I hope that you enjoy. Thank you very much. I love, love, love my package of goodies. And I can't thank you enough. I really feel like this uh, YouTube online community is... Um, it's kind of like family and it means a lot to me. So thank you. I'm going to end here. All right. Thank you. Bye.